So we've just been talking to Paul and he says there's a bit of a secret surprise here at Colchester for us to find. And I think we've found it because they've tried to cover it up. They've not done a very good job. Now to me, this just looks like the student manual lathe, but there's something peeking under the cover. So most people know the student as being sort of the industry standard lathe. Everybody's had one, everybody's run one. They're in schools, colleges, all up and down the country. But not like this one. Because I think the first thing you'll notice is it's got a full CNC control. Now these are manual machines. So they've used the same base, the same slides, but then they've added the new stuff to it to make it a full CNC lathe with, it just, it, it looks amazing. And this hopefully will become the standard that apprentices get to learn on. And one of the main things is, this has been designed and engineered completely in the UK. The guys here at Colchester have done everything. They've redone the covers, they've redone the bed, Everything's been done here in the UK. And some people might be wondering why would you need a full CNC control on a manual labour this size? But the best thing is you can now turn a manual lathe into a production machine. You can still run this in full manual mode, you don't have to use a CNC control. But then you get the best of both worlds. The added cost, you can make back in weeks, months, depending on how much work you've got through it. And you can see here how they've been designing, changing, everything's been done here and slightly hidden away from, from us all to see. So this hasn't even been released yet. We are the first people to actually see this and see this running because this isn't quite finished but it will be coming to the market very soon and I tell you what I think it's going to be a big hit <laughs>